we're here today at Temperature Pro with the owner and president, Ghassam Zieb, who um, established this about two years ago here in East Brunswick. And first, before we get started, I just wanted to thank you for being part of, uh, one of the first people, actually, to be part of our Shop East Brunswick program. For those who are watching these spotlights for the first time, that's our uh, shop reward program for individuals who uh, shop and frequent at participating merchants, whatever discounts provided, gets accumulated in an account and at the end of the year that account gets transferred directly over to the tax rolls uh, so that you can use that for property tax relief. Individuals who live here but rent or those who live outside of the town are also um, encouraged to use the program but instead of a property tax reward they'll actually get a rebate check. And um, what we're doing is spotlighting those individual uh, companies and merchants who were first to sign on and we totally appreciate the fact that you took that uh, leap of faith and, and joined the program. I was hoping that perhaps you could talk first a little bit about where you're located, your hours of operation, so that residents uh, can be a little bit more familiar with the services you provide. Absolutely. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. And we do appreciate you coming out here to our shop, uh, Temperature Pro. We are uh, located on Hearts Lane. Uh, between Main Street and uh, Tice's Lane, right in the heart of East Brunswick. And we have been here about two years, like you said, uh, coming December, we'll be here for two years. Uh, we uh, service all of Middlesex County and the surrounding counties as well. We installed new heating and air conditioning equipment, uh, whether it's a replacement of existing equipment or for new construction. We do service repairs also for heating, air conditioning, boilers as well. Uh, we do uh, conversion of oil to gas boilers. Mm -hmm. We have, uh, we've been promoting maintenance plans also, which are uh, plans that allow us to maintain uh, either a homeowner or business owner equipment by making it live longer, just like when you take your car to, to a service shop. And lastly, what we do, we've been trying to promote uh, indoor air quality you know that uh, especially in this region in the winter time we tend to spend more time uh, in inside the home as opposed to outside and believe it or not it's been scientifically proven that the air inside of our homes could be worse than the air outside <laughs> so uh, there are things that could be done uh, again we're trying to, to promote that and i i should also mention that uh, we do uh, mini split ductless systems i don't know if you're familiar with them but these are the difference between those units and a conventional heating and air conditioning system is there is no ductwork involved. Mm -hmm. They have been gaining traction lately because they do solve problems, uh, either additions to new homes or to uh, basements, garages, areas in a house where it's either too hot or too cold that you can't service. A mini split ductless Mitsubishi unit would be the perfect solution. So that's in a nutshell what, what we uh, what we provide. Especially considering that East Brunswick, most of the communities were built in the 50s and 60s and 70s. So it doesn't come as any big surprise that a lot of the uh, houses are getting to the points now where roofs and systems such as what you're talking about probably need to be either be repaired or replaced. Uh, and we're also looking to try to encourage more businesses to come back into town. A lot of that redevelopment is going to be involving uh, reworking of properties that just don't work any longer. So there's a lot of opportunity. Uh, but for the residents that have um, these units that are older, these are huge expenses when they do go. And so I think it is important that they try to do something to maintain it so that you can get a, uh, hopefully, a little bit extended life out of products that you know have uh, a limited lifespan and the res cost for those repairs and replacements can be very, very high. Absolutely. We, uh, we do offer a couple of options for residents or business owners whose equipment has um, seen better days. Uh, we always give them multiple options for them to choose from. And on top of that, we offer financing. We have a couple of different plans that, that will match the, the need of any uh, homeowner or business owner. So yes, it, is, it, is, it could be expensive to, uh, to replace uh, heating and air conditioning equipment, but there are ways to, to finance it, if you may. It's a necessity. You need to do it. You just want to try to do it in a most efficient manner, try to save energy, which I'm sure is uh, a large part of what you're trying to moat. Maybe talk a little bit about uh, energy savings, since that's such a big part of uh, people's budgets, and anything you could do to bring that down is going to be extremely important, even with the systems that they have presently. 
Absolutely. And we do stay on top of what the state has, the clean energy program, that they offer rebates to customers who are upgrading their systems. And the higher energy efficient systems they install, the higher the rebate. Uh, I don't want to get into the technical details, but a SEER is how they measure the efficiency of a system. The minimum that we can sell or anybody can sell in the northern part of the United States is a 13 SEER. That's the absolute minimum. Mm -hmm. You can go up to a 20 SEER, and every time you go up, you're saving a lot on your energy bill. This is a great way to go, and the state does promote that as well. We stay on top also of uh, rebates uh, provided by manufacturers. A lot of manufacturers offer rebates on these high energy efficient systems. So we stay on top of that. We offer that to the customers. And uh, yes, I mean, every dollar counts. And with, the, uh, with this program that you are promoting, it's even uh, more discounts. That's great. Well, we do appreciate the fact that not only do you provide a service that's absolutely necessary here in the township and the county, which I believe is your region, uh, but you're also more than willing to be part of these type of programs which take big businesses and bring them down to something small, just to me and to most residents that live here. It's the small businesses that, that really define in large part uh, the, the strength of a community and that relationship between business and the township and the residents is, is one that we treasure and that's exactly why we put this program together. So on behalf of the township and those of us who, um, uh, who have put this program together, I can't thank you enough for being one of the first people to sign on. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. We appreciate you coming to our shop.